What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Tayman3 and today got y'all a brand new video. Um DNA bomb with every gun starting that series. Well basically I've already started with episode three and Millie. Just wanted to start out because it's my favorite number. But this is episode one and the gun is the BAL twenty seven and it's just original BAL, you know, no um no elites, professionals or enlisted weapon. And uh yeah, this is um, playing some domination on the map Ascend, and it's just regular domination. It's not ground war, and uh, I'm about, I'm gonna tell y'all the class setup that I used to get this awesome gameplay. And uh, I, later in the video, you might see me trimming up a lot of of the of the clip just to make it more compacted and more of the video being killing instead of just running around and stuff. But as you know, the as I said, Battle 27 is the gun. Um, the attachments that I use for this uh, weapon is stock, foregrip, and extended mags. And of course, I had to use the wild card primary gunfighter in order to get the third attachment. And um, the I did not have I didn't have a secondary and using this class setup because it's pointless using one because they all suck. Um. I had two perk ones and they are low profile and flight jacket and I had to use the perk one greed in order to use the second perk. Um I did not have a perk any perks in the perk two slots. Uh the perks for perk three were toughness and scavenger. Them two are the probably most required perks to use to get DNA bombs. Because toughness, so you can win gunfights and scavenger. So you know you won't you won't run out of ammo and low profile, so people won't see you on the UAV. Because ninety percent of the people use UAV that play the game, and flight jacket. So you know a lot of people use um, all kinds of these explosives and stuff, and it's 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 good to use that perk. And um, the kill streaks that I have I have two of them and it's UAV and system hack and the upgrades that I have on the UAV which it requires a thousand points to get is support and threat detection I feel threat, de threat detection is a must to use for the UAV because it's basically like an oracle from uh, Call of Duty Ghost but the customization for the system hack is uh, it costs 650 650 points to get it and all I have is assist points on it people might have um, different opinions on that class setup that I just told you I mean but I mean it's you, you can do what you want but this is what I use and obviously I can get DNA bombs by using it but um as you can tell I still play Call of Duty Advanced Warfare and um, as you can see as you know or if you don't know if you kill yourself People reverse boosters know that when you kill yourself, you know, make sure stats go down. But when you kill yourself now, like I think it's eight times that uh, it will kick you from the game. And I think it's so stupid that Sledgehammer would do something like that just to stop people from pub stomping. I mean, if we were to play competitively, then we would play League or it's called Rank Play. And we would play that. But we're not. It's called Pub Stomping. There is a big difference. But I'm just gonna play, you know, if my KD goes up, I'm just gonna you know, just keep playing until the next COD comes out and not play this game no more. But uh hopefully you know they'll cancel the skill based matchmaking. But uh this game's about to wrap up. And uh make sure y'all do drop a like on this video. I'm hoping to try to get five likes on this video. It's not hard to do, but um Comment down below on how you think I did and subscribe for more awesome advanced warfare content. That does it. I'm out. Peace. Friendly incoming.